Ooh, what is up guys, Jane Poop here, back with more Donkey Kong 64! In the last video, we have finished off Creepy Castle, which is the second to last stage of the game. And we've gotten every blueprint, we've met Snide, and we handed all our blueprints in. And we got basically every golden banana in the game, if we look at our totals. Uh, we can see... Well, obviously we got some... Uh, we got some duplicate ones as well, but yeah, you can see seven from Angry Aztec. That's just because I did the glitch uh, and all that. So yeah. So in this video, we are going to do the final area in this game, and I need to go to the one to be faster. Um, and so the only things we need left that you get in this area this next level, is, um, is two banana fairies, you get them both at the same time, and one more battle crown, I believe, um, or it might be two, I'm not sure, but, um, but that, that's all we need, and then, um, then of course the last, uh, boss key to open K Lomzy, but we get that in here anyway, so, other than the, and then, and then we need to get the secret banana, which is what we get after getting all fairies. So, yeah. I also recommend getting some ammo, uh, some homing ammo. Uh, it's recommended to start with Lanky Kong because then... Oh, I don't need to go that way. <laughs> oh, I can get the homing ammo again. <laughs> Yay, I can get the homing ammo again. This is like the, one of the best places to get them. Uh, okay, yeah, you can just use the one pad. You have full capacity of those. Let's go to the, You can glitch uh, in, uh, through this lobby. In fact, I'll show that off real quick because I don't know if I'll ever come back here. So. Uh, with Diddy or Tiny, what you can do is uh, you can go this side and then. If you time it right, yep, there you go, you're through the wall. One of the easiest out of bounds, and then you can also... You can also get here, easily. Except I cannot go back. Well, that's another waste of time, but, ah, whatever. Now I, I can get more homing ammo, yay! I'm not intended to do that, but... Uh, no, not DK, LK, Lanky Gong. Alright, now let's walk. There is other ways to go through here, like a ledge clip to the lava, but it's so difficult. So anyways, let's go this way then. To this new world. The last world. My god! <laughs> I like how a clap trap is on his feet. Intruder alert! Intruder alert! It's the Kongs! Wake up, you fools! And activate the machine! Oh, that was Kate Roll, I thought it was the Kremlins. <laughs> Don't tell me what I can do! Please, Master, just give a few more hours. No, the time has come! Goodbye, DKons! Oh, and they're snide. Here's the deal, Kong. The blueprints you have found uh, have allowed me to block the Blastomatics firing sequence for 50 minutes. You must locate and deactivate the machine in the main cavern. Hurry or you won't have an island to go back to. Yep, this is why you need the blueprints. So, welcome to Hideout Helm. And there's no cutscene this time. And yes, we have a timer. We have 50 minutes. The timer depends on how much, how many blueprints you get. So if you missed one, for example, you'll have 45 minutes, uh, for instance. Uh, so now we need to be, I think we need to be chunky because I saw a... So yeah, you've got to be quick here. The timer even carries out on... Um, during... Um, oh, come on. The timer even goes during cutscenes and when you're in the tag barrel as well. So you got to be very quick. 
Though it is possible to beat this in like 30 minutes or something, so... But if you have no blueprints, then this will like be 10 minutes and it'll be nearly impossible for casual players. It would be possible for speedrunners, of course, because I've seen speedrunners use 10 minutes, but they still manage to beat it anyway. And now we need Tiny Kong to go for the small hole. And the music here is so epic. Just go for here. Then, then I believe we get Diddy Kong. I think we do. Yep, we do. Because then Diddy Kong, what he does is. Oh wait. Oh no, we get Donkey Kong first. Because he needs to press a switch. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, this is really the final showdown. Yep, there's a switch here. This part of the music is so awesome and epic. Oh, you have timer. So what we're going to do here with Diddy Kong is we've got to fly through all of these hoops uh, in a few in in a minute. They're just easy to go through. There we go. Then the all of these doors open and they're all numbered. Now I don't know if we can do top one yet, because the top one can only be accessed with Diddy. There's the K. Roll crown, by the way. No, we can't do it yet. Okay. Alright, let's get down then. <laughs> we still got squashed. I believe the first one is with Donkey Kong, so... Oh, no! Whoa, 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 whoa! We need to be Chunky Kong first to punch all the gates. So... Okay, it's not there. Okay, I need to check. Are these... These are so Donkey Kong's there. Okay. Uh, I forgot the first one I punched. Um, that one is for Tiny, because it's purple. I think, yeah, the instrument tabs get added later on, so... Yeah, we have to do them in order. And that one's Flanky, so the first one was Chunky. We punched. Right, now let's get Donkey Kong. No, no not Tiny. Not TK. DK. Oh, there we go. Play the bongos. We got 45 minutes left. And then here, we have special kind of barrels to do. We have K. Rule barrels. But these also bring out challenges. And in this one... Hey, we've got to go in this barrel... And shoot... And shoot all of these targets... In the time limit. Oh, crap! The timing is just going to be difficult. We just need to get free. Oh, I'm not going to do it in time. Not going to do it in time. Oh, crap! No! <laughs> it's the timing you got to do for them. Oh, there we go. do 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 One more. Yes! 
Well done! Yeah, these are going to be the last times we hear the well done line. Alright, now for this one, you have to do both of them. And this one, we're Rambi again. This is the only other time you play as Rambi. And what we've got to do is we've just got to hit 18 Kremlins, or Critters. And do not hit the shocks, otherwise you will die. Or fail it! Whoa, that was so close. Well done! There we go. And then... We can get this banana medal. And yeah, we can get these banana medals. There is a warning, I would say, but I'll do it at the end. After we do all them. Right, Chunky Kong is next. You can just collect them. Yep, they're not collected through normal bananas anymore because there's no colored bananas in this world. It's just um, banana medals by themselves. So, here we go. Alright, Chunky Kong is next. Okay. Chunky, wonky, wookie, woo, woo, woo. <laughs> then. Play a damn triangle. Just like how you can kill the enemies in there as well. This time it's this way, and then... And then... Here we go. Oh boy. Right here, we gotta hit one thing, and that is... We gotta find something. We gotta find a Kremlin, I think. In this one. Yeah, there we go. Just run him over and then boom. That's an easy challenge. I don't know why that would be in the last kind of world. Different kind of music as well. And then, oh, we got a gun. Which means we gotta shoot. Oh, one more. Well done! Yes! Chunky Kong's is so easy. <laughs> he was struggling to climb. I wanted to punch so I could go forward slightly during the cutscene. Next up, we need uh, Tiny, and then next will be Lanky, and then Diddy is last. We get that banana medal. Alright. Oh, God, whoa! Okay, um... Where's the tag barrel? It's that. Alright, Little Kong. It's time for Little Kong to now uh, uh, go for hers. So, here we go. Is that. Oh, unless em the enemies do float whenever you use the music. But wow, I thought there was a glitch happening, but no. Okay. Let's go in this K rule barrel. And we just gotta do Tiny's uh ponytail move. Oh, but if you put if you touch the floor, you lose. So yeah, we're basically playing the floor the floor is lava. That's a good Netflix show as well. If you haven't if you haven't watched the Netflix show uh, The Floor is Lava, guys, then you should do because it's really good. Oh! Oh god. Touch it! No! I almost had it. Weird music glitches. Oh, we then we have to <laughs> press the switch. I forgot about the switch. Oh my god, I forgot about the Nintendo Switch. We have forty minutes now. Oh my god. No, don't touch the... The floor is lava, Tiny. Oh my god. Don't you realise what the lava is? It's deadly. You know that. <laughs> okay. Well done! Yes. Good girl, Tiny. <laughs> Oh, little cotton. Alright, um... 
Uh, get in the barrel, there we go. Oh, now we gotta bounce on mushrooms! Alright. Okay, this is easy. Oh, I could have bounced on the mushroom again, but. Well done! Yes. And then we should have. <laughs> oh, we just long jump in the background, but we don't move. Alright. And now it's Lanky's turn. And then after that will be Diddy, because Diddy can only go. Because only Diddy can go up to the five. I kind of like how they make crunching sounds because they're eating oranges. Can we? Oh yes, into the barrel. Yes, good girl, tiny little Kong. Okay, now King Louis' turn because he wants to be like you. <laughs> okay, just kidding. Uh, trying to make uh, jungle book puns here because he's an orangutan. So because both Lanky Kong and King Louis are orangutans and they have long arms, so. <laughs> we can hear his crunching sounds here in this animation. <laughs> That's so funny. Wait, there was there was a critter in here as well? Or was it a claptrap? I'm not sure. Uh, whatever. Let's go here. Oh, we need to race. Get in the barrel, Lanky. We're gonna find... I think we hit that, and then... Race to the end. Yes, I was correct. Nice. So far, it's been like 60 minutes in recording, and I think like 40 minutes we've done this so far. So we're actually doing good progress. All oh, right, I think this is where blast the singers. Blast the singers. Don't you mean shoot the singers? It's best if you have homing ammo. So you have to shoot these ones three times. Well done! And then... It doesn't move during the cutscene in a while. And lastly, Diddy Kong. That needs to get his guitar. Alright, King Louis done. So now... Uh, get out of my way, fat clump. Right. Go down this way. And then Diddy Kong's turn. To fly up. In fact, let's do... Um, in fact, no, we'll do that last. In fact, no, we'll do it now because we have infinite crystals during the timer, so... We don't have to waste any crystals. Let's do this. The Shockwave Showdown, yes. And you still, your timer still carries on during these events. Yep. So you need to be very quick and you've got a massive timer here as well. You've got like 99 seconds, wow. So this is the last K. Roll Crown in the game. them. Gotcha, both. Get the watermelon. There we go. But your coconut crystals still get used properly here. I don't get why. Oh, there's another one. Oh, it's another. Because what? Huh! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Huh! Oh! Don't fail! Yes! 
Oh my god, it's not facing Diddy, it's facing the lights up there. Oh my god. Alright, where's... Because I want to try and get there. Who? Can I get there without the rocket barrel? No! Okay, we need the rocket barrel. We have th 34 minutes. Alright. Okay. Guitar! This skin is gonna really be awesome. <laughs> okay, last barrels. Let's start with this one this time. Oh, we gotta get the cage. We gotta get our rocket. No, not Simeon Slam, did he? We need some rocket barrel over these switches. Except they don't homing on them. Also, I would expect them to home in, but they don't. Okay. Okay, we got that. Okay, there we go. And then we grab him. Well done! I think for the last one, we should do a massive well done, shall we? Alright, here we go! Uh, get out of my way, Claptrap. It's time! We do this one. What's this one? Uh, oh yeah, beat a Kremlin and then bash the switch. Because the Kremlin will have something. If you hear a chime, then that means you got the right one. One of these ones. Oh, it's this one. All right, here we go. Well done! <laughs> yes! How about that? And then, there's our last one. And then, the blaster macetic is turned off. And then that door opens. And there's our last banana medal in the game. Now, a fair warning to these banana medals. Uh, if you're playing the American version, do not turn off your console after doing them without collecting them first. Do not turn off your console after, well, before collecting them. Otherwise, if you come back here, they will be translucent even when the blastomatic is off and you won't be able to collect them. Yeah. Yeah, it's a glitch that's only in the American version. Uh, but they fixed it in European and Japanese versions. Right, let's change to Donkey Kong, shall we? So Donkey Kong can uh, kick K. Roll's ass. Is it this way? No, whoa, 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 whoa. I can't see because the camera won't change. All right. I think it's up here. Right, yeah, it's this way. So we just gotta. Yep, here's the, there's the boat that they were driving during the cutscene. Oh, there's the one pad. And then here is a crown. I think we need eight to go through here. Oh, we get a cutscene. Oh, there's K. Roll. Oh, okay. He's gone. Oh, he's here. Oh my god, it's the flying croc from Donkey Kong Country 2! Oh my god. It made a comeback to this game. And we go this way still. Uh, if the camera don't, doesn't be weird. There, there, this is where K. Rule was sitting. Oh my god. And there's pictures of all the Kongs. I don't need your gun out. So we have Donkey, Diddy, Tiny, Lanky, and Chunky. All on the board. And then this is where he watches his television. <laughs> so, and over here. We have Nintendo and Rareware coins. You need them to go through here. 
And then, not only that, we have two banana fairies and our final boss key. Let's get the banana fairies first. If you just get one, you get two of them at once. Yeah, you see it like that. Well done, Donkey! You've rescued all the fairies now! Come back and see you! Alright. Wait, have we got infinite crystals? Or is it just me seeing things? Okay. Right. Duh! Duh! Donkey Kong! Yeah! So yeah, we got our final boss key. So now all we gotta do is now um, leave this area. Yeah, there's only one warp pad here. There's no two, three, four, or five pads around here. It's just one. And it just takes you all the way here. Not that you would ever come back here, I guess. I guess it's for if you, like, do all the Blastomatic stuff, but you don't have enough crowns or you don't have the rare old Nintendo coins. But let's just walk back. And then we're out of this area. And now, all we've got to do now is get the secret uh, banana, which normally you get with Tiny. So I'm going to try something different to get that. I'm going to try and do the same glitch I did to get the, sh to get the shockwave attack in the camera early. I think I've got... All banana fairies. Yeah, I have because there was a cutscene. Okay, got all of them. We got we got over 200, and 200, but there's 201 because of the secret one. We got all battle crowns. We got all keys, all banana medals. Or if we had a game shot code, we would have the ice key as well. But of course, no. Um. So let's go. Wee! <laughs> all right. Okay. Uh, in fact, did we get the banana behind here with Tiny? I don't know if we did. Yeah, we did. Okay. I think we got all bananas. So let's do the glitch again. Do, do, do. Let's do it. Mash B. And then. Then we're just going to get ourselves into the loading zone, right here. Don't know where I am. Just going to keep rolling. Where am I? Right, I'm on the loading zone. Come on. I've done this before. Can I get out? There we go. Just jump in there. Right, let's see. Donkey! Oh, Donkey! You did it! You rescued all the banana fairies and every star piece to the banana fairy island! Thank you! I give her the veil! Our secrets! I kind of like how she still says Donkey and not just Tiny, because you're supposed to only come in here with Tiny. And then, there's the secret banana. Donkey! Thanks once again! Banana Fairy Kingdom is entirely grateful to you and your friends! But can we get this with DK, or do we have to be Tiny? Uh, it's translucent. We have to be Tiny Kong. You can see it's got the Rareware logo on it. Yeah. Also, this Golden Banana, strangely enough, has more protection than you think. Not only restricting it to Tiny, unfortunately, I would expect it to be collectible of any Kong because you don't, you're supposed to only go in here with Tiny anyway, so what's the point? But... The other thing is that, um, um, if you somehow get this, try to get this early without all banana fairies, yeah, this is the intended way to do it. Show it off now. Um, if you somehow try to collect it early, because the devs were concerned about you hacking and glitching to get this early, where if you go near it, it will be invisible until you get it. So, yeah. But, look at that glorious banana. And that means Tiny Kong gets more golden bananas than all of us. T -t Tiny Kong. Yeah, all Kongs have five, but Tiny gets six. 
Why? If only there was a banana duplication in DK Islands, then. Then again, I think there is a glitch to have um, every single uh, place have seven bananas for each Kong. So meaning... Uh, you can have all that, so... So now, it's time for Chunky to do the dirty jobs. So, it's time to go in here. <coughs> oh god. And then, the last key. On the eight. He not only marches, but the cage goes up. Spins with sails. Well, oh, there's the flying croc. And King Gay rules in it. It starts to fly. You get this really awesome cutscene here. Oh, it's coming from the crown. That's so cool. Then, yep, okay, long as he's outside, I'm, I'm surprised he's so massive, then when we go into his uh, prison area, it looks so, like, small, but it, it seems like he's so massive, so I don't know how he managed to get out. He's, he's almost, he can almost reach Fungi Forest from here, oh my god. Starts playing like a kid at the seaside. <laughs> He's so fast. Oh, there's that rock. Oh no, it's this one. Oh, but he manages to crash land the flying croc. So it's a bad thing that he tripped, but it's a good thing he still managed to to knock out the flying croc. Now, where is the flying croc now? You may ask. Well. If we would think to go to Fungi Forest again, and go to the free, and then look behind us. <gasps> this thing here. Yep. This is where it is, and this is where the final showdown begins. This is where the main event again begins. So let's go inside and start a real match. Here we go. The final boss of DK64. Wow. Oh, it's a boxing ring! We have this microphone character. I don't know his name, but... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen! Welcome to the main event of the game! We bring you 12 free minutes rounds for boxing at the undistributed heavyweight championship of DK Islands. Brought to you this evening by Rare and Nintendo in association with K Rule Enterprises. Introducing. The Kong Family! Versus King Crusher K Rule! Oh my god, we get to do some rocky plagiarism. <laughs> okay, just get in. It's this music, this beat, this song kind of sounds like the rocky theme. A bit. But almost. Okay. Judges at ringside are no existence, and the Utah Tikkun Keepers tonight will be acting the fair in the Bow Manor. Oh, and these are the judges. Wait in the soul, 800 LBS? I'll give you the Prime Primate. Donkey Balboa! King K. Creed! <laughs> so yes, this is a boxing match! And so, we do this with every Kong. So first we do Donkey Kong. 
so we just gotta wait. And then... Oh, we're in the barrel already. <gasps> wow! That was a quick hurt. Wow. You're normally supposed to wait, but okay. Okay, so yes! We get to do Rocky! <laughs> so yeah, we get to just... Um, we get to just... Uh, but instead of uh, Sylvester Stallone playing Rocky, we have Donkey Kong! Uh, and instead of... Um, I think it's either uh, Carl Weathers or, or Michael B. Jordan, depending on which creed you're on about. Oh crap, he still punched me. Uh, we have King K. Rool! Or Crusher K. Rool, as he's known as in this game. Oh, we can just hit him there. Alright, anyways. So yeah, you have three minutes for each round. It's like real boxing. Oh, he's still punching me. I don't know when to end it. So yeah, just gotta wait. The music here is so epic as well. Oh, no! Are you serious? Alright. Oh, he almost had it. Come on. Yes, there we go. And then he knocks down. Oh, so we don't get another chance with DK. Okay. And now, making his way into the ring is the champ of the chimps. Diddy Balboa! I'm just gonna call them the Balboa family and not the Kong family. Alright, so with Diddy Kong is next, obviously, because he's the second Kong. And we gotta dodge this attack right here. And then, rocket barrels. Oh my god, we get to cheat! Because when we go in here, we need to shoot these lights. We still have the, um, we still have the, um, humming ammo, surprisingly. Ha! It's on his head! Ha 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 Oh, and then he's gonna go on this one. So we have to go, go for the ones that, that are above him. I guess it don't matter if we lose the humming ammo. There we go! Whoa! Okay. You have infinite ammo, luckily, so... Oh, whoa, 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 okay. No, 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 no. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Good boy, did he? Bad boy, K. Roll. King K. Creed. Because <laughs> it's like Rocky and Creed. Like, I haven't watched those films, but I just know that, um, uh, I just know about them somehow. But, uh, okay, um, there we go. Fall on him. There we go. Do Oh, there we go. And then the last one falls on his head, but he doesn't take it off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Saved by Bell. I guess they're all saved by Bell if we uh, beat him with a Kong. We don't get a second chance. He boasts the longest reach of currently in the world today, introducing... Lanky Balboa. You would expect it to be Tiny Kong next, but no, it's Lanky Kong. This one's so interesting because he still has this light thing on him, so he can't see anything. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 don't touch me. And then, because Lanky Kong has long arms, what we need to do is we need to hit these switches. Like that. And then there's a barrel that has a banana shape on it. And then... And then what we gotta do is wait for him to go on this banana. So we gotta wait for him. Okay. Now! Because he'll listen, and then he's like, Oh, he's there! But if the banana's there, he'll slip. You want to do this. All right. It doesn't matter what order you do them in, but... But the other ones do get lost eventually, so... Oh, he's just on the banana, so he will slip indeed. 
If, if he doesn't manage to go on the banana, you will, um, he will, uh, hurt you. He will hurt your feelings. Uh, don't stretch your arms. Throw the barrel. Okay, there we go. We can use the same one. Oh, my God. No! No, no not that way. Oh, now we go. There we go. Do, 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 do. There we go. Oh, one, uh, oh, we just used this one three times, okay? Oh, God. Come on. We got the three, and then... Oh, he touched me! It don't matter. Uh, okay, um... Gotta wait. No! Not there! Now! <laughs> we go! Lovely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Saved by a bell multiple times. And then... We get this cutscene. Oh, they're trying to get it off. And yeah, the next round will be Tiny Conquest. So we can see her over there. <laughs> he's like, oh, he squashed all the critters. It's almost like he doesn't want to see it. It looks like. But he's still fine somehow. All right, onto the microphone guy. Hailing all the way from DK Islands is the girl with the world! Tiny Balboa. Or little Balboa. <laughs> Alright, round four. With Tiny Kong. We utilize her hair spin. So. Uh. And then he's pulling up his underwear. Trying to get himself a wedgie. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna wait. We can just do it like this as well. Oh, into the barrel! Because we need to go inside his shoe! And smell his feet. No, nope. we have his toenails. And what we gotta do... We gotta shoot his toes when they face up. Because he feels a little pr... <laughs> Alright. So, here we go. Uh... Alright, oh god. Get in the barrel. I think there is a certain time limit for the barrel. But the timer does not carry on when you're in his shoe. For some reason. Now, now the second one will take two hits. So, and etc. So, so you can just, uh, you have infinite ammo as well. So you can just shoot like this. Uh, wants to touch me with its toes. Ew, gross. And we're smelling his feet. Probably smell like the, uh, I don't know, the critters. I don't know. Probably smell like crocodile breath. I don't know. Oh, I, I was successful doing that. Let's try that again. Wow, you could just do it like that. Wow, you don't even need to do the hair spin. Oh, I could have got in the barrel. <laughs> it's, it was almost like he's going, Help! Help! I'm stuck in the mud! He's like, Oh my god. Uh. Toenails trying to touch me. Gross. There. Shoot that. Take wiggles as well. <laughs> oh no! It touched me! No! Tiny got to touched by uh, K. Rool's toes. Oh no! By your smelly toes. Oh, this part of the music's awesome. Yeah. So awesome. Oh, he's pounding twice here. Oh, no. Oh, oh, don't smell his bottom. That is gross, Tiny. Oh, my God. Never knew girls were into that. <laughs> uh, get in the barrel. There we go. While oh, he's going, oh, oh, I'm stuck in the dumb mud. He's like. 
Fucking hell, there's some spit on my gamepad. Whoa! That was a close dodge. I'm gonna shoot this toe right here. And there's a Kong! And, and, and she's nibbling my toenails! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Ah, I'm getting touched by his toenails! Oh no! Right, one more hit. Oh god! There we go! Tiny Kong's done! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Saved by Bell and it went off. He broke it. <gasps> Tipping the scales at might lead. Two Boris is the hard hitting. Chunky Balboa. This is the best part of the fight with Chunky Kong. Because King K rule does this. Yep, he decides. Oh, and then he goes invisible as well. And there's a chunky switch. So we gotta dodge him by hitting that switch. Now this switch, you can you can actually hit it with the normal simian slam, but it still shows the blue one, meaning you need the super simian slam. But you can actually use the normal one. So now we, we uh, no, don't do that. Go in this barrel. We go in this hunky chunky barrel, and then we do the best part ever. And we primate punch, and we punch him in the face. There we go. This is the best part of the fight. We chunky punch him. There we go. Let's go here. Do the switch again. All right, there we go. All right, there we go. And then again, he will go faster. There we go! PUNCH! Nice! I'm actually doing well with this fight. I do sometimes struggle with this fight, but not too much. I think I might have just gotten used to it. Alright, here we go. We need to be invisible again. Oh, he's trying to get me, but he can't. Then he will turn invisible. And we gotta punch him there! Chunky PUNCH! There we go. And now, the final part! The final chapter of DK64 is here! Oh, it's there, okay. Alright, here we go. This part is slightly harder. But, he'll go sideways like this. And then, Chunky Punch! We've done it, guys and gals! Yes! <sighs> Nintendo and Rare's attempt to plagiarize Rocky is done. <laughs> Just kidding. Because <laughs> they're trying to think they say they're better than Star Wars. Even though I think Star better than Star And then he's like, rrr, rrr, I'm gonna get you! But, that whistle. <laughs> Oh my god, it's Sexy Kong. King K. Roll Toad. <laughs> okay, I guess Candy is trying to cheat on Donkey Kong now by dating K. Roll. Okay. What would Donkey Kong say about this? He's like, come here, girl. I want you so bad. He's like, but it's just a distraction because Funky Kong is here with a massive shoe con. And then, this is the awesome part. And then, boom on his bottom. Yes. Then he goes flying. <laughs> he goes flying everywhere. Oh, and K Lumsy's still alive? How does he manage to fit in that? <laughs> he just launches him back <laughs> to his island. Or to the other side of the sea. <sighs> I don't know. 
that is Donkey Kong 64 then, guys. Oh, there's the banana fairies. <laughs> Going into Donkey Kong's home. Oh, and these, yep, this is the, this is the ending, this is the end of Do Donkey Kong 64. DK64. Well, there's Candy Kong. So we get to see all the people who made and published this game. And all that. So, yeah. And Diddy Kong's on top of DK's house. Don't go smashing it. Oh, how did he get the rocket barrels? I have no idea. Okay, and then look at Chunky and Tiny together. They're just playing. I don't know what they're playing. I don't know. The support team! Okay. Hmm. Oh, where's Tiny gone? She's like, where is she? <laughs> She get up there. <laughs> then DK's. How did Funky get up there? I don't know how, but okay. It's a weird dance he's doing. Yeah, this is what he does. That <laughs> so funny. Oh, and that. <laughs> Has he pretended to, like, use a gun or something? Oh, yes, El Godfrey. For some reason, his name was removed in the European and Japanese versions. I don't know why, but it is here in the American version. Oh, Donkey Kong is carrying a golden banana. To his banana collection. And there's Cranky Kong. How did he get up here? He's so old. How did he manage to get up here without dying? But Noah testing! Well, I know it's Nintendo of America <laughs> testing. <laughs> He's playing with his feet. It's just like me in the morning. <laughs> okay, just kidding. <laughs> okay, then. Oh, it's because the banana's heavy and he's trying to, like, Oh, how am I going to carry it? And Cranky's like, Get up, donkey boy! <laughs> Trying to wake him. Oh, he's awake. Okay. okay. Yep, he's got a collection of golden bananas. But it looks like that's more than 201. It's probably the duplicate ones as well. I don't know. Oh, don't carry Cranky like that. He's he's that old. He might die easily. I don't know. And then the squawks are here. And they start farting uh, red smoke. Okay. Oh, and there's the seal. Oh, there's Trough. But where's Scoff? Oh, he's up there. He's so fat. How did he get up there with him being that chubby? Oh my god. Oh my god, he. he... <laughs> the, they're passing gas everywhere. Oh, that is gross. They just want the whole place to smell. Oh my god. Oh wait. They're doing something. Like... Oh, there's Lanky Kong. DK! Oh, that's the credits done. And I think after getting all bananas, everything 100% or 101%, or over if you do the duplicates, you get bonus cutscenes. I think this is one of them. I'm not sure. But... Well, there's Candy Kong. But what is going on? What, what is that? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there's Tiny and Chunky. Oh, 
unless that that's the tail. Oh my god. Oh, there's Lanky Kong. Oh my god. He's like he's doing row, row, row the boat. <laughs> oh, Donkey Kong's on the tail. Yep, I did. Yep, it's K Lumsy. And oh, there's Diddy Kong on his chin. It's K Lumsy. Yes, the, uh, apparently he can boat the Kongs to the other side of the uh, other side of the world. I don't know. It's a good thing he's still alive. But how does he manage to fit inside that cage? Because he he, he 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 seems bigger. It, on the island uh, compared to that uh, thing he was in. And then we get this, which is definitely 101% only that you have to get in order to get this cutscene. A studio. Oh, King cut out his hand. Auditions. Oh, it's like the making of DK64. It's like, but this is not a film. This is a game. Oh, there's Cranky Kong. Oh, he's the director. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, DK's in the background. Oh my god, is he holding something? Or <laughs> it looks like he's covering up his PP. <gasps> he's like, oh, don't look at it. It's private. <laughs> oh, but then he's like that. What is he doing? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, the outtakes on. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Are these like bloopers or something? But with a white background. Oh, the starfish enemies. Okay. Oh, they spell out DK. Oh, that's cool. Oh, dog it on. I remember seeing a golden beaver. <laughs> He's crying like Chunky Kong. <laughs> oh, it's the burping choir. What? Oh, the mermaid? Oh, and Candy Kong. Ah, just. Oh, and Tiny? What? Oh, just all the girls. Okay. Even though one's a mermaid and the other two are Kongs, but okay. <laughs> the critters are like, oh, they're so hot! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and then, on the other side, Donkey Kong and King K. Rool. What are they doing? Are they doing pancake cake or something? I don't know. Oh, there's the beavers. Different colours, and then. Oh, there's a massive one! Okay. Oh. Oh, DK can't pull it. And then Tiny's here. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, it's the banana fairy. I don't remember those sounds. Oh, there's Scoff. Oh, that's all of it. So yeah, that is Donkey Kong 64. I pretty much enjoyed this playthrough, I've gotta say. Um, no, we're not gonna look at the DK rap again. And not this either. So let's check our percentage. We usually have 101, but we got over that, so we have 
104! Oh my god! 104%! Wow! That's like the same amount of percent you can get for Donkey Kong Country 3 by beating the uh, harder mode. But when you get toughest mode, you get 105%. Wow! Okay, <laughs> but we but normally we get 101% um, as the maximum, but you can go over that by duplicating bananas. Of course, we would have gone over if we gotten more duplicates done. Like, some others were... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I accidentally dropped my batteries on top of my keyboard. I hope that doesn't mess up with the recording, but... Okay. But, yes, um... For some reason, we got 104. I guess this is the fourth Donkey Kong game that Rare made after all, so it would have made sense. So, yeah. Uh, now, options has nothing interesting. You have Kong Battle, which is multiplayer. I don't know if I'll ever do this. But, if I did, then I can invite someone to do this, and I can play DK64 again, and then do that, but... In the mystery menu, uh, you uh, these are depending on how many fairies you unlock. So these are cutscenes, and you unlock the different cutscenes um, uh, at the end of the game. Like for the intro story, you can do an amazing glitch, but I'm not gonna do it for this playthrough because uh, I'm pretty sure most of you know already, or some of you do. Uh, all right, and then here we have the bonuses. So we get to play, uh, we get to play the Donkey Kong arcade game and Jetpack, along with two other games, Rambi Arena and Engard Arena. I think we'll do them before finishing the video off. The bosses, so we get to fight the bosses. So Jungle Bosses, Army Dillo, Aztec Bosses, Dargadon, Factory Bosses, Mad Jack, Galleon Bosses, Puff Toss, Forest Bosses, um, uh, Dog it on, caves bosses, uh, army dillo, and then castle bosses can cut out. So yeah, and then last, oh, no, first, and then battle mode. You have crusher on or off. Uh, the crusher, if you don't know, crusher is an enemy. Was an enemy from the first Donkey Kong Country, uh, where which the blue ones you can only kill with deep Donkey Kong, and then the black ones you can only kill by throwing barrels. Uh, uh, there's nothing else here, I don't think, no. Uh, so this lets you play as the Crusher in multiplayer. And then finally, Cheat. What this is... This allows infinite ammo on everything. Like, on instruments, crystal coconuts, film, oranges, ammo, and coins. But for, but for ammo, I think it's only the homing ammo. It's not the normal ammo. So let's go and check that out real quick. Um, with our 104% file. Wow. So, you can see, got infinite uh, homing ammo. This is very useful. We have infinite oranges. Yeah, we have 999 banana coins. Uh, uh, but of course, we only we only use the homing ammo anyway. Uh, so, so of course you you won't need the infinite normal ammos, so, yeah. In fact, because uh, we've got 101% uh, or 104% in our case, but, okay. Let's see what, let's see what DK's Golden Banana Collection looks like. Will, will they be there, or will they not, or is it just for the credits purpose? They're not there. In fact, we'll go and visit DK's house as well, because we didn't really explore. Not even in the first video. Uh, the first episode. So, there's all these bananas. Oh, no, it's gone! There's no golden banana collection. So, it's, so I guess it's only in the credits where you see it. So, yeah. Alright, in that case, let's go and visit DK's house. Do -do 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 -do. Let's go in Donkey Kong's house. Let's have a bit of exploration. There's his um, there's his boombox right here. You can go in here with any Kong, but yeah, there's his picture of Candy Kong. 
and then his bed. Apparently he looks at her while sleeping. <laughs> okay. Just in that pose. Does Candy know that he has this picture? I don't know. Um, and then, um, uh, and then over here there's nothing other than TNT, but in pre-release footage, there was a shower stall with with a poster of Banjo and Kazooie on the side. And and then there's also an unused cutscene in this game, and it will warp you to uh, an area in Crystal Caves. And um, and it's probably where you would have got the ice key. Uh, and it's, the, it's that room with the gorilla gone for uh, Chunky Kong to get his golden banana. And there are also hidden enemies that are not in the game properly, but there are unused in the files, including the Red Clap Trap. Um, and I, I believe if you would have killed them all, then you would have get the ice key. But but even if you enable this function, uh, you don't get the ice key. Uh, there's a separate cheat code to have the ice key in your inventory. Uh, so yeah. So yeah, I think um, that's about it. What happens if we quit the game? Do we still get that cutscene? <laughs> we still get that cutscene, even though K rule is clearly in the flying croc now. We still somehow get the DK Island destroy cutscene. Wow. Because they didn't do something like that in Banjo Kazooie, where if you saved 2T, uh, then you don't get the cutscene with 2T uh, transforming into uh, an ugly version of her, and then Grunty turning sexy. You don't get that cutscene after saving her. But for this. For DK64, you still get the K rule destroying DK Island cutscene, even after even after uh, finishing Hideout Helm and before doing the K rule fight. That is weird. Anyways, let's just do these two uh, uh, bonuses. Um, uh, and that is Rambi Arena and Engard Arena. So, you yeah, have the have high score there. Uh, so, so let's try it. Let's give it a go. So this is what you do in Rambi Arena. <laughs> hit the moving targets. So yeah, we're just going to hit these enemies as fast as we can. It's best if you hit the, um, it's best if you hit the, the gold, the gold beavers, because then... Oh, so these, I think this is the only time you find the gold beavers. So we just kill these beavers. Yeah, take that for being in a hard, a hardest minigame ever, which is beaver bother. It's best if you get combos as well. Oh, wow. We might get a high score. Oh my god. Yeah, 132. That's good. You just had to do that as fast as you can. Then you enter your name. I'm just going to enter DK. And you can't use the D-pad to move. It would have been easier. All right, DK. Oh, whoa, 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 we have to do it again? Or do we just quit? Yeah, that's a quick game. Okay. All right, now for Engard Arena. Uh, this will be the last thing we'll do to, for today. It's the same thing, but with uh, Engard, and we just gotta swim through those hoops in the time. Okay. Except this might be difficult because I'm not used to playing as Engard too much. Okay. Do, 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 do. You can just swim through the same hoops again. I can just do that. You can just swim through the same hoops again. I might as well just do that. Most of the time. And that's how you get the top one there. But we just gotta swim through these as fast as we can.
do it do it do Okay, 115, okay. And then, uh, just same as before, DK. Okay. So yeah, the others are just DK Arcade and then Jetpack. So yeah, I think that'll be it for today, guys. So, and also in the sound options, you can uh, enable different sounds and all that. And then options. I don't know if we get anything new in the options. Aside from story skip, reset eye scores, uh, GP cam, widescreen and that. So, I'd like to thank you guys for watching these series of my videos of me playing DK64. So, it's been a pleasure and all that. Uh, this is like the fastest time, uh, one of the fastest times I've ever done this game. Wow. So, yeah, I'd like to thank you guys for watching these series of videos of me playing Donkey Kong 64. It was a great pleasure for me to play this game because DK64 is such an awesome game. It's better than the Donkey Kong Country trilogy, in my opinion. Uh, the best Donkey Kong game ever. Uh, I wouldn't say the best N64 game ever because there's probably more N64 games that are probably better than this but, uh, for other people. But still, um, I really liked this game. And um, it's probably my favourite DK game of all time and all that. So, anyways, I'm going to be signing off and uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. So I shall see you guys in the next playthrough. Unsure what it will be, but we'll see. So I shall see you guys next time. Jane Pabow. See you guys next time. Bye!